hello hello and welcome back to the child's financial channel we are here learning how to live on a budget save money coupon and get out of debt all right you guys so in today's video i want to share something that i have recently found and that is walmart clearance shopping now i've always been familiar with the clearance section at Walmart and I know at certain times of the year they mark things down but I'm gonna go through everything that you see here and we're gonna go over what it regularly costs and what I paid for and I'm gonna tell you which ones was unmarked clearance okay here we go so the first thing I want to go over is just these bottles of this is a mean green pine power multi-purpose cleaner they are normally priced at $2.97 and these were a dollar and fifty cents and they were located on the clearance aisle i just thought that was a really good deal for this big bottle because this is like a 48 ounce then also these hand sanitizers now as you can see regular price they were two dollars and 98 cents and they're marked for two dollars however when i scanned them with my walmart app they came up one dollar so i did purchase a few of those now this Reynolds wrap here this is the 70 square foot it's normally priced at I believe six dollars and 88 cents let me check my look yes six dollars and 88 cents and I think I purchased these for two dollars and seven cents a piece so I thought that was a really good deal and those were unmarked clearance meaning that there was no clearance sticker on them or anything they were just sitting on the regular shelf and they just rung up at this particular store for two dollars and seven cents now i also purchased some of the smaller um this is the oops, sorry i'm getting caught out of the way this is the 35 square foot and these are regularly priced i believe three dollars and 12 cents let me grab my notebook you guys so i'll make sure i'm giving you guys the correct prices here so the 35 foot Reynolds wrap is normally priced at three dollars and 48 cents and I purchased these at one store for 87 cents that is unheard of to get Reynolds wrap for 87 cents I can't even get the off brand for 87 cents most of the time so let me give you guys a shot of the barcode so you can check your stores to see if you have any in your area that are on sale let me back up here and give you guys the barcode for this 70 ounce as well okay now here are some ziploc bags that i also found they were regular price three dollars and twelve cents in their price on the shelf at my store actually for 94 cents and i'm gonna put a clip right here of my shelf what my shelf looks like in my store there was a bunch in the store and right next to it was regular price and there wasn't as many and i'm just like get the ones with the frozen designs on them I mean, you're gonna probably just throw them away anyway so for 94 cents i thought this was a pretty good deal as well okay now here is one of my favorite finds you guys this is a backpack okay let me get the back up here so you guys can see all of it this is a backpack normal price $28.44 I paid five dollars for this backpack so we already got a backpack for my youngest one for school next year these sweaters in the back right here i have four of them they are all regular price fifteen dollars and 88 cents yes fifteen dollars and 88 cents for a sweater which i would not pay that much for a sweater i'm trying to get that in focus you guys so you can see that it's 15.88 there we go now i'm gonna flip this tag over you see that it was priced at nine dollars even on the clearance sticker but when we scanned it in the store it came up four dollars all of these sweaters 
came up four dollars so i thought that was a really good deal and we picked those up and we'll put those up for next year so we'll have some brand new sweater when winter starts now here is another one of my favorite finds i love to get sheets on sale because sheets are high so these are all normal price fourteen dollars and ninety four cents for three of them i paid four dollars and ninety three cents a piece and then one of them i think it was this one and i'm gonna flip all of these over so i can give you guys the barcodes on the back of them i think it was this one with the hearts this one was five dollars and 68 cents but all the rest of them were four dollars and 93 cents which is a really good price now let me flip this one over so i can give you the barcode on this one so there's the three different designs there of these sheets so my kids was actually in need of new sheets for their beds so this was right on time for us now here is another deal i'm gonna slide these over so you can see this purse which i think is too cute really really cute it was really regular price $16.98 and it was on hidden clearance. It was just hanging with the regular purses and I got this one for $4.50. These six pack of boxer briefs, they're regular price $19.96. They were on sale for $9. I'll flip the over so you can get the barcode on this one as well. They were actually priced in the middle of the store. They had a display and they did have clearance on them. This crossbody purse over here. Let me turn this around. I'll leave it like that so you can get the, the barcode on it. As you can see, regular price, $14.88. I paid $3 for that one. And that one was hanging up in the clearance section. Okay, we got another backpack here. I thought this was really cute. So this is going to be for my oldest one. I don't know if she's going to want a bigger size, but I couldn't pass this deal up. But hopefully she'll be able to use this one for school. But this backpack was originally priced $24.88. And this one was tagged, but it was still hanging up in the regular section. $5, you guys. Cannot beat $5 for a backpack. This jumbo cooker regular price i believe was let me get my notebook let me see 17 dollars and 94 cents i paid four dollars and 47 cents for this cooker and this is a big pot you guys i'm gonna flip it around so you can see how that's a big pot very deep and we definitely needed some more cooking utensils after this year that we've been cooking more so i'm gonna get the barcode for you guys there that might want to check to see if you have these in your store okay so that is some good deals i think anyway i think there's some good deals and i just wanted to share with you guys that you can find some really good deals at walmart to help you save some money on items that you need in your house so for everything you see on the table here, if I had paid full price for it, it would have cost me $314.44. And for everything that you see, I paid $89.88. So it came to a 71% savings, which I think is really good. And all of these items, you guys, we will use in my house definitely. All right, you guys, so that is all that I have for today. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you like this type of content on budgeting, couponing, and saving money, hit that subscribe button so that way you will not miss any of these great deals. I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day, and I am going to catch y'all in the next one.